Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Sonic Adventure DX for the GameCube. Really? <laughs> Get a load of, get a load of, get a load of this, man. Get a load of this, man. Yeah, get a, get a, get a load of this. No, Talos, I didn't see that. That look Sonic gave him, he's like, nah, dude. Nah, dude. All right, this is the sky deck. That's what I just said. That's exactly what I just said. Okay, so this is stage eight. We have a couple more until we reach the end. All right, so we have our first checkpoint literally at the very beginning of the stage. Just in case. Reasons, I guess. I don't know. So, 40 rings right off the bat. Wow, that's. That's a little too much, don't you think? Taking this other alternate route over here. Didn't quite make it. <laughs> what the heck, me? What the freaking. Oh, there's still my rings. Well, how about that? Well, I took my 40 rings. Oh, I'm going to try that again. I'm not going to go this way. I'm going to go the alternate route. Okay, there we go. Awesome. We're going to go as fast as possible, too. This is Sonic. And so we're going to go balls to the wall. Legit. We're not going to make much slowdown. And that, I mean, I guess the reason that you don't want to do it is because you will die a lot. Okay. It's a little glitchy, I guess. You could say. Still good. Oh my god, what am I doing right now? What am I doing? I just can't figure this out. There we go. Just kind of stop in midair. Do the little Dragon Ball float thing. If you watch Dragon Ball, you know what I'm talking about. When they like, just stop themselves in midair, I guess. I don't know. Okay, so, oh my goodness. There we go. Awesome. Sweet. What's up here? What's this? Awesome. We can pick up rings this way now. And this shield was actually first developed in... Sonic 3, and you could actually bounce with it. It's really cool. Oh my god. Oh my god. I think I need to be as high as possible, maybe? Why else would there be ladders? <laughs> okay, so just knock me down a few levels. It's not cool. This game can be kind of like, what's the word? Douchey, I guess. Is, is that a bad word? My mom said it wasn't, so. <laughs> I don't like saying cuss words, but it's 
sometimes, you know, it is what it is. Okay, so it doesn't really make sense how we just got right there. So the mechanics of this part of the level gets kind of iffy sometimes. <laughs> so we're actually outside. And he's firing like tons and tons and tons of weapons at us. Holy crap, I didn't know all these when ups are right here, just to be honest with you. I, I hope you all saw that. I hope, you, I hope every single body that's watching this saw that. so hard to get him wanting to move right now. There we go. Alright, cool. So I glitched through the floor a second ago. And I just did it again. What is up with the stage right now? And the only re reason I'm going to keep this in the actual level, or in the actual let's play, one of the other way this time, is because of how glitchy this crap is right now. This doesn't seem right, man. Okay. I'm going to go this way anyways, so... My god. It's... It's just a little unnecessarily rough. I think. And that's all I had to do earlier. I've wasted tons. And who's manning... Who's Peyton manning these ships right here? Where am I going? I uh, just follow the arrows. Follow the arrows. I guess I gotta wait for it to turn back my direction, perhaps. Maybe I shoot it from this side. I don't remember this. So stupid. There. Killed it. Awesome. So here's Knuckle Stage again. This is definitely probably my least favorite stage Sonic has. What the heck? What's a freaking what the crap? I don't like how the gravity works in the stage. Oh my god. Just don't mess up, basically, is what I'm trying to say. Or what I'm not saying. Oh my god. Okay. If you can't hear my frustration, I'm hoping maybe you can. Or maybe you realize I'm frustrated. But me, my lack of talking is basically me saying, look, this crap is stupid right here. Okay. Sweet. I think I want to stay and I want to get my one up. There we go. Reward ourselves. Okay, awesome. Boom. The checkpoint. Instead of trying to find... That's scary, man. We have to climb, I suppose. Oh my god. There we go. Probably just cheated it a little bit. Well, what the freaking heck did just happen? Can't see a single thing that's going on. I don't think that really matters right now, though. He's shooting freaking his cleaning robots at me. That's twisted. That's twisted, Robotnik. 
Oh my god. Oh my goodness. This stage is really getting to me. It's making me feel stupid. A bunch of you are probably like, man, this is such a freaking easy stage. I'm like, man, I'm just I'm not used to BS. Although I clearly am used to BS. Oh, he's not moving. Okay, I had to jump. And like, random things can hit you, so if you think that you're clear because reasons, let me just tell you, you're not. Okay. Awesome. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? I'll pause it until I get back to where I was. Alright guys, I'm back and just saying the actual design of this crap is horrible. I understand it's trying to be straight up and down, but if you're going to be having to run on the side and run back and forth and do all this freaking BS, make it look like it's normally part of the stage because this camera angle is absolutely killing me. Okay. And like literally like the end is just right over here. But because of how stupid they made the camera angle, it took me almost nine minutes to beat the stage. This is still my absolute least favorite stage for Sonic. And anyone that wants to argue that it's a good stage needs to go rethink some things. Because I'm legit frustrated right now. I'm so upset. Well, Tails, let's check out the bridge. How about that? Here it is. Here's a bridge. Very nice, isn't it? Tis. Tis it is. Alright, so what we do now is we go up here. And we're gonna have our little gamma fight. Bow bow Sonic! What did you come here to do? What do you want to do to me, Sonic? Well, Amy, you've been nothing but trouble this entire adventure. So, I'll let you... I'm going to rescue you, and then you can, I'll let you go. You can go screw yourself. That would be a sucky life, being Gamma. Like, if you're... If you're Sonic X, Robotnik, dude, he didn't want to hurt anything. Like, he's legit just... Like, just let him... Give him some land, let him build his amusement park, city, whatever you want to, whatever he wants to build. Let him build it. That's it. But for someone that can afford so much technology and crap... Why can't he afford land? Like, you know how much that ship probably costs? Probably enough where he could buy a mini country. Like, no joke, too. It's probably super expensive. I wish Game Theory would actually do a theory on how much the egg carrier would, carrier would cost. And then in Sonic Heroes, he has another egg carrier. Like, a fleet of them. How much does that cost? Where does he get this? The funding. Buy some land and do what you want with it, Robotnik. Seeing that you don't steal this much metal, you'd have to fi find it from somewhere and you'd buy it.
Who cares what her reasons are? Sonic, finish him off. Never mind, Dawn, I love Gamma. I love him to death. Okay, so here we are as Sonic, but you clearly remember how in every other story, um, Tells and Amy and Gamma are all gone, but they decide to stay here in Sonic's. Just kind of stand here. We're going to talk to them. I'm going to talk to them for a second. We're going to see what they say. Oh my goodness, talk to them. Okay. No, I'm not. I'm fighting depression. So I think I'll change the ship first, and then I can worry about other things that we might want to do. So this is a really cool spot. This is like Robotnik's little chair. Okay, I guess we're pushed out. We have to redo that little section there. We'll just go in right here. What's, what is this? Oh, this is his bedroom. Here is an emblem, which is collected in his bedroom that I, in an office. Wow, this is actually a pretty legit office. I would love to have an office like this. What is in here? Oh wow, this is like his little, a little toy room, and a couple of chairs. Oh, this is actually really cool, man. Talk about a legit man cave. Okay, but this time we're actually going to uh, flip the switch. Pop the noggin. Cool, okay. Okay, so now that we did that, we'll be ready to go for next episode when we follow Robotnik down to wherever he went. So that's how things are going to work. And thanks for watching again. And I'm sorry for uh, this the last stage that we had. It's really just awful. It's horrible. I hate it. It's not as bad as I remember, but it's still horrible. I hate it. It's just stupid. That's all I have to say about that. But, uh, it was fun. It's been real. But, I'm gonna go now and chill with some family for a little bit, and I'll be back later. So, thank you very much for watching. I uh, hope you liked the video. I'll see you next time. Peace out.